A wealthy lawyer was riding in his limousine when he saw two women along the roadside eating grass. Disturbed, he ordered his driver to stop, and he got out to investigate. He asked one woman, Why are you eating grass? We don't have any money for food, the poor woman replied. When, uh, we have to eat grass. Well, then you can come with me to my house and I'll feed you, the lawyer said. But, sir, I have a husband and two children with me. They are over there, under that tree. Bring them along, the lawyer replied. Turning to the other poor women, he stated, You come with us also. The second woman, in a pitiful voice, then said, But, sir, I also have a husband and six children with me. Bring them all as well, the lawyer answered. They all entered the car, which was no easy task, even for a car as large as the limousine. Once underway, one of the poor fellows turned to the lawyer and said, Sir, you are too kind. Thank you for taking all of us. Slav us with you. The lawyer replied, Glad to do it. You'll really love my place. The grass is almost a foot high. A nun, Sister Sarah, wakes up one morning feeling great. She gets out of bed and decides to go to the kitchen for some breakfast. On her way over there, she runs into Sister Jane, and she says, Hi, Sister Jane. To which Sister Jane answers, I see you got off on the wrong side of the bed this morning, Sister. Puzzled, Sister Sarah did not understand what Sister Jane meant by that, so she ignored it and went on. She's passing by the garden when she runs into Sister Roberta and says, Good morning, Sister Roberta. I hope you're having a great day. Sister Roberta answers, Good morning, Sister Sarah. I see you got off on the wrong side of the bed today. Sarah was now really anxious to know why everybody she meets keeps saying that when she felt so great, so she decided to go and see her Mother Superior, who was in her office. She enters and asks Mother Superior, Mother, everybody keeps telling me that I got off on the wrong side of the bed, but I feel great. The Mother Superior replies, that's because you have Brother John's shoes on. <laughs>